Theological perspectives on sin vary widely across different religious traditions, but they generally converge on the idea that sin represents a moral failing or transgression against divine law. In Christianity, sin is seen as an offense against God, with the concept of original sin introduced by Augustine. Redemption is offered through the sacrificial death and resurrection of Jesus Christ, emphasizing repentance and faith for salvation. In Islam, sin, danab or qadiyah, is any action against Allah's commands. Sins are categorized as major, kaba ir, and minor, saga ir. The Quran and Hadith provide guidance on avoiding sin and seeking forgiveness through prayer, charity, and righteous living. Judaism views sin, chet, as a deviation from God's commandments, mitzvot, and emphasizes teshuva, repentance. The Yom Kippur, Day of Atonement, is a significant time for reflection and repentance. Unlike Christianity, Judaism generally does not believe in original sin. In Hinduism, sin, papa, refers to actions that create negative karma and impede spiritual progress. The law of karma implies that sinful actions lead to future suffering and liberation, moksha, is achieved by transcending sin through righteous living, devotion, and self-realization. Buddhism does not conceptualize sin as in theistic religions. Instead, it focuses on actions that lead to suffering, dukkha. The Noble Eightfold Path provides a framework for overcoming unwholesome actions, akusala, and achieving nirvana. Each of these perspectives offers a distinct understanding of sin, guiding adherence toward a moral and spiritually fulfilling life. If this has inspired you, please subscribe for more.